Well, good morning, woodworkers, and all you other YouTubers out there that might be interested in this. <clears throat> I've been working with a Vixia RHF 600, and it is uh, uh, running MP4 format into Windows Movie Maker. And this is kind of a frustrating thing to me because at first, since I'm not really literate, I guess is the word you want to use for uh, all of the terminology that is going on with computer formats and whatnot. And so this kind of was a real problem for me that, that MP4 would not render properly when I used Windows Media Maker. And uh, this, I even tried uh, going to Windows Live version 2012. That's the newest one that's on the market as far as I know. And I still had trouble with it. So finally I did some research online and uh, different places and discovered, not using my head, and because what I have to do is to take MP4 film clips and convert them to AVI or something like that that is compatible with, with Movie Maker and then I can convert them back to an MP4 which is a smaller file than from what I understand. Correct me if I'm wrong on the size of these two formats. But I've discovered uh, that that worked pretty good. And I'll show you a couple of uh, different little film clips here showing what the difference is uh, when I run it, uh, try to run an MP4 through Windows Movie Maker and how it looks when I convert it to an AVI before I, uh, before I render the Okay, this is uh, a little film clip uh, using AVI format, and uh, here in a, a moment I'll show you uh, what an MP4 is doing on on Windows Movie Maker when I when I render it. Um, this is the only way that I know of to convert this. Now you can use uh, a lot of free uh, window converters, I'm sorry, format converters uh, that you can get online for nothing. And the main thing I think there is to be careful that there isn't some add-ons. And there's usually a way so that you can keep the add-ons from showing up in your computer and sometimes messing up what's going on in the on the computer. Okay, now next I'm going to show you what it looks like uh, running an MP4. Okay, here we are on the MP4 format and I believe that what you're going to see here is uh, either a focal focus problem or uh, something in the uh, Windows Movie Maker program that is just not compatible with an MP4. And according to everything I've read, that's the truth about uh, Windows Movie Maker, that you just simply cannot use an MP4. Uh, I'm not saying anything bad about uh, the Canon Vixia uh, series. They are really a nice little compact camera and they do, they do things that the big uh, humongous ones used to that you had to carry around on your shoulder, it'll do as much as those do in a lot of ways. And so I'm very satisfied with the camera itself. It's just I had to do some learning. And hopefully what I'm telling you today will kind of give you an idea of what to do in order to uh, make it so you can use Google Maker. I really don't know if there's anything else I need to add. If you have questions or if you see that I could do something else to make this work better, uh, let me know. I'm fully aware that there are other programs out there that I 
should, should or could be using besides Windows Movie Maker. But for editing, uh, I really like the way they do it, and I'm used to it, and so I kind of hate the change. You know, an old fellow, you know, they say about old dogs, you can't teach them new tricks. Well, old guys, <coughs> old guys like me, just kind of don't like to change. So, this will be it for this week. Uh, this will be Wayne signing off, and I appreciate all of you who uh, watch my videos. Uh, hopefully they're worth something to you, and you can learn something every week. Sometimes I don't quite get it done every week, but I sure try. Bye for now.